This week we get stoked for Star Wars Day and take a peek in your kitchens to check out your favorite Star Wars mugs. I couldn't choose just one. Kristen Baber here with just one mug now, but a whole lot of Star Wars news for you. Let's get started. Last week, we learned that the Cassian Andor live action series headed to Disney Plus has four new cast members on the project. Star Diego Luna, reprising his role from Rogue One A Star Wars Story, will be reunited with Genevieve O'Reilly, once again playing Mon Mothma, as well as newcomers Denise Goff, Stellan Skarsgård, and Kyle Soller. Star Wars Day is right around the corner on May the 4th, and you know what that means. We've got Star Wars themed snacks, Star Wars themed crafts, and lots and lots of new Star Wars products and deals. Check out these exclusive items from ShopDisney.com's celebration of The Empire Strikes Back, turning 40 this year. We have limited release pins featuring a legion of stormtroopers and some pretty poster art, a collectible Star Wars key, an Imperial probe droid, and this massive Yoda plush. Funko just announced five new pop figures and one pop moment inspired by The Mandalorian, including this new version of The Child. And if you like giveaways, starting tomorrow, you can download a free ebook of Queen's Shadow by E.K. Johnston. To check out the full list of Star Wars Day deals and new offerings, head to StarWars.com slash this week. That's not the only Star Wars Day fun. On May the 4th, tune in to Galactic Builders Live on Twitch at 1 p.m. Eastern Time to meet the co-creator of BB-8. Star Wars Force for Change and First join forces to bring you a live interview with animatronics engineer Matt Denton as he shares what it was like to build Poe Dameron's favorite droid and more. Catch it all at this link. And our friends over at ILMX Lab are giving away four sets of digital codes for Vader Immortal, a Star Wars VR series in honor of May the 4th. Head to their Twitter page starting tomorrow for details on how to enter. Perhaps most fittingly, the entire Skywalker saga will be available for the first time ever streaming on Disney Plus beginning on, you guessed it, May the 4th. The same day you can catch the first episode of Disney Gallery, The Mandalorian, and the series finale of Star Wars, The Clone Wars. Speaking of, we are right in the middle of the Siege of Mandalore arc, and I cannot wait to see what happens next. The penultimate episode in the final season titled Shattered, so you can already tell we'll all be ugly crying by the end of it, airs tomorrow on Disney+. And last but not least, Fans got a surprise last week when the Art of Rebels book arrived a few weeks early. We got a peek at a few pages featuring these early concept designs for everyone's favorite space mom, Hera, studies for Agent Callus, the Grand Inquisitor, and sweeping scenic designs including the Sith Temple on Malachor, and more. You can get your own copy now. This week in Star Wars history, back in 2014, the world said hello there to the new stars of Star Wars The Force Awakens. At the time, StarWars.com published an article revealing John Boyega, Daisy Ridley, Adam Driver, Oscar Isaac, and other stars signed on for the film. Along with a quote from director J.J. Abrams, we also got this photo of the cast shot at the conclusion of a script read-through. Even R2-D2 was there. Think of all the delicious spoilers. Last week, we asked you to share the Star Wars mugs you were sipping from these days, and we got a whole cabinet's worth. Friend of the show, Jonas Swotomo, shared his very on-brand mug. Rrr, to you, sir! Saber Wielder snapped a picture of an elusive Ewok mug in its natural habitat, the Redwood Forest. Tori Fox matched her mug to her sweater. Gray <laughs> shared this sassy droid cup. Captain said they had to. And Maddie sent in a photo of these works of art. That's it for this week, but for more on these stories and other news from around the galaxy, check out StarWars.com. And be sure to join us right here for This Week in Star Wars every Thursday. Thanks for watching, and may the Force be with you.